Yesterday, Kenyan President William Ruto said he met with Asian Prime Minister Ariel Henry and that they discussed the way forward uh, in fast-tracking the deployment of a Kenyan policemen in Haiti. But is it going to work anytime soon? It's difficult to say at the moment, because on the 26th of January, a Kenyan court ruled the deployment unconstitutional. According to the court, uh, it's unconstitutional for two main reasons. First, uh, there was no agreement between the two countries, and then it's not supposed to be possible to deploy Kenyan policemen abroad. Problem solved, according to William Ruto. He said that uh, thanks to the new agreement that was signed yesterday, it's now possible because Haiti is officially requesting for Kenyan assistance. Uh, but it's yet to be confirmed because the document is not public yet. So we have not been able to read what's written inside. During the week, Benin also said that it will send 2,000 uh, men uh, to Haiti. They will work with the Kenyan uh, who will lead the operation on Haiti's territory. And it's very urgent to act uh, as fast as possible because according to the United Nations in 2023, at least 3,700 people were killed by gang violence in Haiti and more than 3,000 were kidnapped.